Welcome to the adventures of Lucia and Glenn. In today's episode, we're going to go to the Barbie movie, have some shenanigans, and finish out the night with a concert at Bethel Woods. Here we go. Welcome to the gallery at Crystal Run Mall. You know, we're becoming frequent flyers here, you know. Yeah, we should sign up for the A-list, I would say. A-list, wait, are we going to the movies? Wait, are we going to see the Barbie movie because Oppenheimer's too long? I don't want to go for three hours. Okay, so you'd rather join the hype and go see Barbie. Okay, let's go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I smell popcorn. All right. Where are we? We're at the movie theater. Stop. Barbie girl. You're Barbie. So, somebody said that they did a Barbie Oppenheimer weekend because they enjoyed both movies. Well, first of all, three hours for Oppenheimer? No. I'll watch it at home. So, we endured the torture of going to see the Barbie movie. We did. Do not see the movie! <laughs> Let me say that again. Do not see the movie! Maybe you'll have to see the part. Do not see the movie! I guess we lost some appreciation for Barbie after she. Never want to play with a Barbie doll ever again. I used to play with them when I was a kid. I don't even want to see one anymore. I don't even want to look at one again. Did you have the Barbies that were so pretty? I had everything. <laughs> you had them all. Did you that have the movie? Barbie dream house? I've had it all. Yeah? Guess, Guess what? After that movie, I have nothing to take away from this movie. No message, no nothing. Yeah, we're probably going to get in trouble for this, but I have nothing to take away. Shame on you, Warner Brothers. Shame on you. We're going on to the next stop. I'm going to eat my life away at the next stop. Well, as I explained, I'm going to eat my life away. We're going into Chili's. Hopefully, we don't have a repeat of the last time, for those of you that have been following the adventure. So, we're going to make sure we ask for permission the minute we get in there. Here we go. Well, it, uh... They granted us permission to be able to um, film our food at our That's why we're sitting in a booth. Don't go in the back with the camera. And that's okay because we weren't going to the back with the camera no. anyway. But it's been a while since we've been to Chili's because they shut down the Chili's that was near us. I know. And I think the last time we actually went to one, we went to the Stroud Mall in Stroud, yes. in Stroudsburg. And they have, you miss they have Chili's. Chili's. I miss Chili's. So this is the closest Chili's to us now. I'll take it. Almost an hour away from, yep. from our house. But this is where we go to the movies and all of that. And so, you know what? Eat more fajitas. Look at this stuff. And then they have this over here too. Smokehouse combos. You can get ribs. You can get sa sausages. Looks like they got some street corn over there. Maybe, maybe we'll order some corn on the cobbies. There you go. I don't know. All right. Stay tuned to see what we actually ordered. My skinny Rita has arrived, and so has our triple dip What's in that skinny Rita? Of, just some tequila, a lime, and a splash of um, no margarita salt. Margarita mix, no salt, and a splash of soda. And Come what on. else has arrived? Mm. What is this now? This is our chip trio dip. Dip, trio dip, trio dip sample. Something like that. Uh, so we have some queso blanco, we have some guacamole, and we have their regular salsa. That is normally a little on the spicy side. So, eat or beware. I'm sorry, what'd you say? I said, what's all this then? Mm. Whoa. All right, so we opted to set up, you're getting a big meal. We have the triple dip sampler, and the, what do they call this one? Thick tray, fried tray. You're asking me like I'm supposed to know. Try three and we have mozzarella sticks, we have Santa Fe, 
egg rolls, and we have these little burger sliders. Yum all. So what did you think? Well, you know me, I love a variety of food, and that's what we just got here was a variety of food. Our um, three dip sampler, the guacamole was amazing, the queso dip was amazing, so, so it wasn't as hot as it used to be, but it was still satisfying. And, and then over here with uh, a little bit of this and a little bit of that. I can't eat the rest of the matzo steak. You better go up. Nope. And our total bill? Uh, I think it's like 15 and 10. It's 25. 250 bucks. About 50 bucks. And I'm bad for the New York area. Well done. Now, why can't all endings end like that? Hmm? I don't know. Definitely check out the chilies here in Middleburg. Food was good, under 50 bucks. We had a great, I'm checking to see if this is our car because he left the car wide open. We had a great bartender. We always have great bartenders everywhere we go. Yeah, this is our car, I think. I don't even know. So, we're going to continue on our day here where the ultimate ending is going to be at Hollywood Vampires tonight in Middletown, New York at Bethel Woods. Wait a minute. Holiday Mountain Ski Fun Park, what? Mm -hmm. Um, you didn't tell me we were going to a ski resort. The ski resort in the Catskill. We live in a chalet. Why do we have to constantly go to ski resorts? Show you why. like it could be pretty interesting. What do you think? I know, right? I could see it now. This is going to be a re-indition of Costas. All right, we're going to show you more from inside the park. It is really nice in here. Ain't it? Yeah. We got a rock climbing wall. We got a happy train over there. A yep. slide of some sort. Yep. Very cool. You might get wet. <laughs> Very cool. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Murphy's versus Murphy's. Yes. And He's got the golden lose, ticket. Lose, lose. Oh, we'll see about that. So there's also um, batting cages over there. Right here behind you. Lots to do for the kids here. But for us adults, we're driving. Fortunately, we did not have the GoPro this time, but it was a tie. <laughs> he thinks he won. No, it was a tie because he cheated. He doesn't know how to play clean. He plays dirty. All right, where to next? Okay, now I definitely don't know where we are. Top golf. God goes all the house. Hey, I thought we said no gambling. You lie. <laughs> you lie. Why you want to go put your money in the mm, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I know we were going to end up at Los Gatos. This is like our what, fourth time here? We, we brought um, your friend Sarah here one time and we actually played top golf. Look at all the fun those kids are having. Over there. Zombie, zombie, um, uh, dodgeball. Zombie dodgeball, and then over here they're playing soccer. There's golf clubs over there, there's baseballs over there, there's tennis rackets over there. We can have a whole lot of fun here on a rainy day, and we did that day. And not have to go to the casino. You don't have to go to the casino. They have a nice little gift shop over here, they have a window where you can pick up some food behind us. Skinny margaritas, thank you very much. What a beautiful day, huh? We're outside of the resorts world, Los Gatos Mexican restaurant. And it was pretty packed out here a few minutes ago, but now it's empty. And if you look there behind me, I see a big chess set. I see some volleyball. I see some cornhole and 50 tables. 
lights are on up here. It's probably very pretty at night. Something to do for everyone. So if you haven't been here, you have to come here. If you go back in the videos on our YouTube, there's actually one where we've been here and we've experimented with the food. It's pretty good. I have an observation, Murph. My shirt matches my pants today. And the shoes! Hollywood Vampire is tonight. Parking lot is now open. Here we go. Rumor has it that the Sharp Clan will be joining us this evening. All right, is that the woods? Yeah. It's a walk. A little bit of a walk to the venue. I'll show you more of the venue when we get there. All right. Welcome to Bethel Woods. We want to go back to the car. Welcome to Bethel Woods. We have more foods at the car. I know. It's going to take forever to get in here. Let's go. And we got company. One, two, three, four. And the boldy pants over there. That was pretty painful. What was painful? Anyhow. Anyhow. Sorry, I, didn't, I didn't mean to spin everybody like that. So on the horizon now? stage tonight is a uh, entertaining little act over there. Oh yeah. Started a couple of minutes ago. Here's the Sharp Clan. Sharp Clan in the house. And the museum, right there at the museum. And the museum. All right, let's make our way down to the stage. It's like a little mini festival. Oh, this is the line for band merch. It wow. Goes back to here. Wow. Mm -hmm. But I can get a busy. There you go. All oh, different types of vendors on the inside, one trip Bethel Woods. So, enlighten us with some Woodstock Bethel Woods history in under one minute. Over here is the actual field where the people all gathered for the Woodstock Festival in 1969. Uh huh. Where we're sitting is where people would have been camping and hanging out nice. and all of that. The interstate that we drove in on was backed up all the way to the New York Thruway and they shut it down and people had to walk all the way from the through through way down to here and see some acts like Jimi hendrix the who janis joplin crosby stills nash and young and many many other performers and what are we drinking today well what are you drinking ah, this is topo chico hard seltzer any sugar mm, only a little bit okay and i atlantic Brewing company free wave hazy Just ipa Non-alcoholic. Mm-hmm. Cheers. All right, on to the show. Bring on Alice. Another episode of The Adventures with Lucia and Glenn coming to you from Bethel Woods. Hope you guys have enjoyed the content. Yeah, man.
subscribe, like, comment down below. See you next time.